got to do all this. What was you last night? Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> we got that. It's not, not editing out. Yes, yes, it is. We're keeping that. Get two different opinions from my brother and my husband, so I'm trying to see what they gonna say. So I'm helping y'all girls out. Okay, so let's get right into the video, and y'all make sure y'all give me y'all honest opinions. Oh, no doubt about that. And I got my questions in my phone, mm -hmm. so we're gonna start light. Okay, so the first question: Do men like girls who wear makeup or natural? I definitely, I, I'm excusing that question because I think you know the answer to that question. Yeah, and I kind of, you know, I I'm, had a hand in raising you, so you already know. Well, I, I, but I, not, this not about I me, feel, this okay, about okay, okay. other yeah, girls. Yeah. I, I mean, it has to be about you. It can my, be my in view. general though, but this this is, you I'm speaking saying, for the guys though, y'all are speaking so, for the guys. Yes, for the guys, I think a uh, mixture, uh, I think uh, the, the majority so of people so like. it depends. Yeah, well, I think if we do a majority, I think majority of dudes do kind of like that makeup. Yeah, that, that doll look thing, because that kind of indicates that you pamper yourself, how to take care of yourself. Mm -hmm. You know, me, nah. I like, I like my, I like my. Nah, really? Room. I mean, in because general, though, because they hide, so like, right, makeup can hide a bad skin regimen. That's true. That's true. I understand that. They don't really pamper. They just, they just come out. Up. You know what I'm saying? I don't say too much to get dolled up. They may be going out. They come out. The whole beat face. You know, well, get if you're gonna get super deep to it now, I'm, ta I'm talking about like if a girl taking care of the, the just the makeup stuff. Now you're thinking about all the other stuff she's taking care of. Okay, y'all, we back. My camera died, so I had to go to the phone. So I hope the quality is still the same. Okay, so question number two: Do guys send their friends pictures of girls they talking to, like new pictures? Oh no, no. <laughs> no. Wait, girls, girls, you serious about? No, like girls that you talking Just to. Random? Like, say you went to the club, you saw her, and then you go. Oh home. yeah, yeah, yeah. You can get a new talking with that shit, probably. You still say no? I'll be in club like that. Well, see, but the thing I'm is, speaking for guys. Look, run! Don't be scared because I'm sitting right here. I'm just saying. You so you ain't never seen when you talk to. I ain't other. never seen. Right, this, this so man, I ain't. A, a, no dude, a friend, homeboy, associate of mine. When well, you was in college, you they ever say that they got a that they got a they, they got a new picture of any girl I was talking to? Now you I was in college, so, so they got a new picture of you. You weren't talking to me in college. So yeah, that's what I'm saying. If it's a girl, if it's a girl that uh, you serious about, you reserve that. Right. Yeah, you ain't sending that out. <laughs> no, I ain't never. But if it was just a, it's just a random, and then you know some some freak chick. Okay, number three. Why do men? If this is a two-part question, why do men cheat, and what are the signs? Y'all can get some jingles real quick. Uh, I think them. most dudes uh, cheat because it stems from a, a cultural upbringing that you need to get as many bodies as possible, uh, and, and it's really not. Uh, you know, well, of course, she gotta be uh, attractive, but sometimes the chick not even as fine as your, your girl. Your yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. But I think as dudes mature, and you know, of course, some people mature uh, quicker than others, then you realize that that's dumb. And, uh, but I think that uh, if you, uh, if 
and the signs, the second part, of it, the signs of it is really none because dudes gonna act the same because they <laughs> it don't affect the, it don't affect the dude's psyche. It's yeah. just like it just. Because like I think dude, dude, like for dudes, it's like we don't catch feelings. The beat for like that. Beat. So like for women, it take. I know it's a, it's, a, it's a dude's question. Like for women, it take them. You know what I'm saying? It's, yeah, it, it'd be it'd be a long drawn out. <laughs> yeah, yeah you know what I'm saying? Long, like, yeah, it'd be like a, most, general. Yeah, yeah. most. So it's like a long, drawn out process. And they'll either be doing it to get back at the person. They hold it. They'll do that quick to get back at the person. But for the most part, a woman's going to get emotionally connected to that person. Yeah. So, so, I, I so like, for I'm us, for us, like, we, 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 we're not going to get emotionally connected to that person. You know what I'm saying? Because, like, for us, you know. I don't know, because sometimes when people cheat, it be like, Months, 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 you know, like, like and they but, had a side but, piece for that, 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 that six months. But that's just your side piece, though, man. Like, no, ain't no love there. When you talk to somebody for six months. Who say y'all talking? You see what I'm saying? So You got to talk to somebody to have sex with you, them. Yeah, you talk and say, hey, where you at? <laughs> set, the, set the appointment. <laughs> set the appointment. Set the appointment. So that's what I'm saying. I'm serious. Like, okay. like we, we would not have connections with a, with a person, you know what I'm saying, like, emotionally to where, like, we even just thinking about like for us it's just like it's just like a get off you know what i'm saying and, you know uh it's really just uh activity it's like, really like yeah. i want to play basketball i want to work out that's what i'm saying because like you said like it, it they ain't necessarily got to be beyonce you know what i'm saying they can they, just be anybody they, they can be they can't be <laughs> Like, ah! they, nah, they can't be crushes, nah. Yeah. It's a medium between Beyonce and crushes. Okay. You know what I'm saying? They can happen. You know, shout out to the crushes out there. Yeah, everybody. Everybody. everybody they crushes. Yeah, everybody. They, they, they crushes. Everybody. They crushes. Everybody 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 they crushes. Love it. Oh, love that. Love a sister with natural hair. Yeah, I think most people will say that. I'm going to sister. If a sister passed by, you got you gonna have to smell the actual fragrance. But like the hair, you gonna smell the oil, the natural. They they they're not natural. The weed, you know what I'm saying? You may they just flat out everything. You gonna smell the heat of the glue. You know what I'm saying? So like so like that part, we got we got to do we got to do the oil that, that and stuff like true. that. But I'm just saying like. I wish that it was a way that, that they could smell like hair mango hair and tang, yeah, mango, tango. Smell, and stuff. Hair can smell a little good. I, uh, I think for me, it's more so the uh, the juices that leave behind my bed. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, the, the pillows. pillows like yeah. That. Once, it's, that once, oil, once, once it's stained, it, it's the, it, that, yeah. yeah so, that's true. Um, I do just that. The beat provided by the beat. I live in that part of it. But I, I'm more so of a natural hair. You prefer natural hair over weed. Question number five. Do you guys care about girls' body count? Yeah. No. Y'all, they were quiet about that. Yeah, I'm trying to think. It depends. It depends because, it depends on the, because guy. the body count body count is important, but then at the same time, it's not important because we all got to pass, you know, we all got to pass with everything. So it's like, you know, we all got to pass. <laughs> My bad. Kid phone, you know. But we all got to pass. So like the body count, I, I think I think for some guys it's not so much of a number because you can meet a girl. So you can meet a you can meet a girl and she can be great and everything, right? But you might y'all you y'all might be y'all thirties. So you can't you can't control. You're not gonna not talk to the girl because she done been with ten dudes or fifteen dudes and then but she's everything like she's thirty. That's the most way I'm on. I'm just, I'm just giving. Oh, okay, got you, got you, got you. Like, you, you, know, you, know, you know, in the mid thirties, whatever. I'm just saying, like, if she had that many guys. I'm like, dang, we had that many, whatever. Or if she thirty something, she only had two people. Like, oh man. But I think, I think for a lot of dudes, it's more. <laughs> that's I'm lot. just giving an example. Who I'm knows the natural number? Uh huh. He said two. I said that's a lie. Oh, I said, but who lie. knows the natural number? You never know the natural number, truly. But got you. I'm just saying, like. Well, what other number they yeah, give you? Yeah, add, yeah, add 10 to it. Yeah, that's my general rule. But I'm just saying, like, like it's not like they code. Um, I'm just saying, like, I think for some guys, it's not so much this number. It's about who's on that number. Like, it can't be but my homeboy. Cool. It can't be uh, my homeboy on that number. It can't yeah, be somebody, that, somebody that I see all the time on that number. Oh, okay. You know what I'm saying? Some guys won't even talk to that girl because they homeboy, they play sports with, or somebody they know did it. You know what I'm saying? Like, we'll deter it. We may smash it, but, like, 
we ain't gonna go serious with them because that person is on their body count. So the number, the number to me never really just just truly matter. You know what I'm saying? But I mean, that's just kind of what it, you know, what those parts are made for. Just. You know, not to be ran too. So, yeah, so, I mean, that was that was my You got to preserve, preserve it. You know, that's what a woman comes. She has to do her thing to preserve it and bounce it back. But I'm just saying, like for me, it's just it just to be like who's on that body count. So it just has to be a lot of people. So in your opinion, do you think body count? Well, in your perspective, for yeah. guys, do body count matter? So my my only hesitation is because I'm now at a point in my life where I'm thinking totally different than I was when I was younger. So, uh, a body count to me now is irrelevant. I don't oh. care anything about who you talk to, who you, even if it was a homeboy situation type thing. Like, so long that you, I get it now. I, you know, I'm saying, I get where you're coming from with that, but like now, like, so long that I know about it, you know, you up front, like, oh yeah, I used to talk to so and so. Long time ago. Yeah, but now I'm like, too, because my mindset is like, now you with me. And if, even but if even if Buddy had you while I had him, we could share the same story. But well, so would this be somebody that you would marry, or did just somebody that you'll be? No, I mean, if I mean, I'm saying the body count don't matter. Now, at, when I was younger, it did matter. It, okay. that, I mean, I never asked the question how many, but in your hearts of heart, you always yeah, want to be you. like, like, yeah, thank she, you. yeah, all that kind of stuff. So, um, but now nah, it don't matter to me. Number six. Is lingerie required or it really don't matter? It, go, it ain't gonna stay on long. Yeah, it, that's so it's good. I mean, it's good. It's really good. It's good. it's good to see. <laughs> it really I ain't wrong. It's good to so see. So you don't want to see it. You ain't. You ain't care to see it. I want your butt ass naked. I'm no, sorry, I'm saying I want your butt naked. No, it's good to see occasionally. True, you know what I'm saying? Because like you know, get that little vision plus you know, versus your t-shirts and neck and whatever. whatever. But because. Some of them they make where it stays on and, it, and it's, 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 it's easier access, not easier access, but like they got some where the access is easy and you, know, you can keep going the whole time. But for the most part, it's a good, it's a good view for a second to give you something different to look at than a bonnet or a t-shirt or taking off pajamas or something like that. But like, it's only going you know, like 2.2 2. 2. 2. 2 seconds. I ain't on. trying to deal with no puzzles. It's, I ain't trying to go. They got, me no puzzles. They got some of them ways to be open. You going in there trying to flip around, come up with, like, <laughs> but like we doing a little dance too. And I'm like, okay, all right, oh man, come, come ready, come out the shower. That's what, hot skin, that's a lot of you right there. Hot skin, hot skin. That's the sexy thing to me. Number seven. What makes a girl attractive? Um, uh, for me, I'm more so. Body, a body type. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So I like mine. Okay, we BMW. On the, on the thicker side. But thicker than a snicker. Yeah, I like mine. What about BMW? BMW? Yeah. BMW. What is that for? Body made wrong. Oh, I ain't never heard of that. Yeah, I don't fuck with that. Like, <laughs> body unproportioned. Like, yeah, like, 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 like a, a pair. Like a, like a parenthesis at the bottom. Like, like a pair or something. Yeah. But on top of that though, that's only one layer. The, the next most important thing is because I feel like I'm more of an intelligent guy. Um, so you gotta be able to hold a conversation that's and make you laugh. Um, you got the body type and can't do nothing with, like can't um, hold my interest in you. You ain't no track. That's true. So what you think? I mean, it's definitely, it's definitely, you know. Sense of humor for sure. Why are you looking at me? I'm just saying, you know, you talking. You know, definitely a sense of humor, but like, you know, I like a little style, you know, hair. You know, for me. Um, I used to get a wrist to do, like, that, you know, you know, you know, like, wrist for like the first kind of thing that, you know, some people like blood, some people like thighs and skin, but for me, it was a wrist. So, like, you know, Breast, you can get my attention a little bit, you know, but then, like I said, it's just going deeper, like a sense of humor and just, you know, family oriented, like that type of stuff, attracting values. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Number eight. Is why do guys like IG model pictures, but don't want that girl to dress like that or post pictures like that? I mean, it's a difference. Like, like I think, I think 
they're they're doing that simply because of they're trying to get likes. That's a lot of them that's their income from the social media, stuff like that. So like, you see something, yeah, you might like it. You know what I'm saying? You might not like it or whatever, but you didn't necessarily mean that all my girl and she wearing it. It's about what it is. You know what I'm saying? Like your girl can wear something tight, you know, whatever, you know. But I mean, we talking about like like a lot of stuff that be out there. Yeah. Like just but that's most of the but, pictures. But, like, but you because, look at that picture but, she got. Me, me liking thousands. It, but me liking it doesn't mean doesn't mean I could I could have liked the pose. I could have liked the background. I could have liked the the shoes. Who could have liked just like? I'm just saying. You, and you, this a female. But listen though. You even just like no female shoes. No, but it could be okay. She could be a pretty girl too. And it's something about what she got on. Not you know so. You somebody clicking that like button on Facebook. I or think you're trying to sugarcoat. I ain't sugarcoat. But somebody click a like button on, 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 on you Facebook. Ain't, you ain't liking it because you're Instagram. Seen. No, I'm saying you you think on one layer, oh, they automatically liking what but she got, got what she got room. revealing or what she got out. But I'm saying, so no, so which part is it? It could be a big booty, but you're talking about what they wearing. So, so I could like it because the book the booty. So you asking you asking why do we like it but they don't want our girl wearing it? But you you going deeper by saying it could be you could have got a big booty. But she could have on a swimsuit and then your girl go put on you don't want your girl go put on the same swimsuit and pose showing her booty just like she's showing her booty. Yeah, I don't know her. So, yeah, so this this this, you this know is her. basically That's what you did with that. The you know reason know? the reason most dudes don't want that is because uh dudes uh, most dudes think that the their female is a reflection of them, right? So if my girl is out there half naked and stuff, being flaunting, you know, showing showing all her goods to other people, either one, you you seeking attention from other dudes, right? Or two, um, other two other dudes are you know lusting over my girl. So that's why most dudes don't want to put their girl in that situation because they you know most dudes egos is like, hey, I don't want. You being out there, being in a situation where you know other dudes is you know, yeah lusting over you, doing all that kind of stuff. So that's yeah. why most dudes don't want their girl doing that. Yeah, because so you it's contradicting, basically. Not, not really contradicting. You don't know that girl, right? right. That's for her dudes to deal with. Her that's what I'm saying. By that's... Posing that or putting that on, like if she got it on and got there far, then it deserves a like. You can, you ain't gotta like it. But but that doesn't necessarily mean because I like them, they go, okay, oh, I see you like this, I'm gonna go buy the same outfit and put it on. Number nine, what one thing non-sexual that turns guys on? Non-sexual. Yeah. Just like you think non-sexual, yeah. Uh, I, I mean, because I, I think that kind of goes down to the how deep the relationship is with that person. Because, you know, certain things that, like, for example, just having uh, uh, someone that genuinely being concerned about your well-being and how you do it, turns uh, a certain emotion on, then like, oh, she, you know, oh, shoot, I love her, and now I'm in the mood, and now I'm like, man, I'm gonna love up on you. So what you say, babe? To me, I think it'd be uh, really like more like the, like the conversation with Jesus. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, a conversation. Okay, question number 10. Do boob and breast matter? I mean, I'm gonna say booty. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. Uh, for me, sexually, it does. If you ain't got no titties, and I ain't no titty dude, but if you got like, what is the A cups and stuff like that? She raised her hand right there and they disappeared. That's a turn. <laughs> I can't say that, that, that's just me. When, I, all, when, when, all, they, when they do this, all, and then it's just flat chest. You know what I'm saying? When they all know they're good. Mm, no, but your hands go up at some point. Yeah, they move. Yeah, they move. So, so for me, I'm more of a uh, booty guy. So, um, so long as you got that little plump you know, up, up here. Yeah, work with yeah, it. Yeah, for me. It could be an A cup up there, but the booty yeah, guy is like let's, a let's go to a B. Let's, let's do the minimum of a B. <laughs> Uh, and then a booty plump, I'm good. You good? Yeah. But so what about you, baby? It's not even a for me, you know, but it's, it's over the years, you know, moved to the, to the buns. Like, I think, I think breast big guys push the spot on my mind. So, so they matter. Both of them matter to you. 
okay. That's all we have. But breast not so important. Right. So guys be going to grab on to front and back. I don't want to drag this question on and off, but like, for me, sexually, titties don't do nothing. They just have a declaration. They got eye, they eye candy. They eye candy. Yeah, but that, the bun, you need that. The bun, that, that's, that's where all the action is. You need that. I have to have <laughs> that action. I need the sound effects. I need the visual. I need the ripple. I need all that. Oh, so, Jesus. Yeah. But, you know, titties, you know, I'm done. Yeah, definitely. 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 Ye
and when you're looking straight, you can see like out. You know what I'm saying? It's like it could be a woman there and a woman there and a woman in front of you. Like you, you gonna look, you gonna put your eyes on it. You know what I'm saying? But like it's a different, it's a different when you just look at it and you check it out. Like you double back it or you you trying to make it known to where you got in the same the same spot or same area somehow. But that's that's another level. Like yeah, you gonna look. Yeah, so to his point, uh, and I'm more on the savage side, like, I got group, group messaging, married dudes dropping IG stuff in the, uh, you know, screenshots of this or whatever. Now, are, are they checking them out? Yeah, but I think um, that they're not going to act on it. Right. You know what I'm saying? So, but yeah, yeah, they just look in and say, oh, check this girl out. Yeah, like that group, like, yeah. like that. So like it's, it's you know, looking at stuff is like it's just like art. You know what I'm like, Check out this piece of art. Not, yeah, but, but it ain't just looking at it like. I get that. Yeah, you know, like, I might want to buy it. I got you. I see what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> some, some people might. Yeah, you can look at it. Number 15. Do guys cry after a breakup? I did. I did, I did once I was young. I was like in eighth, eighth grade, you know what I'm talking about? So okay, well, so I'm talking about guys, like with guys now, cry over breakup. I think, I think so. Uh, you mean like adults? Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. Heartbreak, heartbreak, yeah, you cry. It's difficult, man, because, you know, most dudes want to put on a facade of toughness and all that kind yeah, of thing. Yeah, why do they want to fit to? Uh, I think it's. But I think what do do dudes cry after a breakup? If they really cared about the relationship, then most of them probably would share some tears or something. Now me, you know how I, we ain't really tearing up like that. You know what I'm saying? Like I feel bad, I don't like it. You know what I'm saying? Have I cried over a situation? Yes. If it went so much to break up, it'll be more so like, oh, the chick did, did, me wrong. did, yeah, did some some type of act and uh, violated my trust or all the kind of stuff, which led to the breakup. Right. The breakup itself. You know, celibacy is is, is, is is a real thing, you know what I mean? But I'm just saying, like, it, it takes two unique people to make that happen. So what you're saying is... It's so very, very difficult. Could I, could I, if I, if I could, if I could say if I could, you know, I probably couldn't. Wait, so, you know, probably couldn't do it. Once again, you know, I, I hit that question, I want to get super deep. So are we saying that no, like, oral... It's part of sex. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you might pay. get a peck on the cheek. Like well, so yeah, for me that's a that's a deal breaker for me. But I think if someone do choose to do that and then they're able to articulate that to their partner, 
and then they have a realistic time frame on the beat that, what they expect. So, for example, if if the, if the celibacy, if you practice celibacy, and you tell them to do that, and then you start to say, hey, um, you know, I'm looking to be, you know, get married and all that kind of thing, setting your, you know, telling your goals. And, most questions is what's your five year plan, right? And you be able to articulate these type of things because the problem is when you hear that it's talking about I'm waiting for marriage, then most dudes gonna be thinking like, shoot, we ain't gonna get married. We no time soon, right? Yeah. Or and, you know, and if that's and if that's not the goal in the immediate future, then what are we doing? You know what I'm saying? So uh, I can I can either one wait for this person because I think this person is super dope and. Waiting for that moment will make you know marriage, the honeymoon night that much better. Or two, can be like, well, I ain't in a point in life where I'm trying to get I'm married. I'm not, you know, I'm not trying to get married, so why well, I'm going to wait? Wait, yeah, so. I go find somebody else. Right. Yeah. So basically, what they saying is, these guys out here finna be single and have a good time. So like I said, it take it take two unique people to do that. So okay, and finding, so you and think finding two finding unique people in that same way like often is very, very difficult. So basically a person who been having sex, uh a person who been having sex like that, uh, a girl that been having sex and she made a baby. Well what's that girl? Well, she the transition. But then say the boy, he used to having sex. You think it's hard for him? Like, you, you said they already had sex before. You, yeah. Like the, so the two partners already had yes. sex before, and now the girl said, "Hey, yeah, I want to practice that." Oh yeah, that's, that's tough. Okay, yeah. I mean, it depends. Well, but that's a person that you've been with. Depends, though. Depends on like, yeah, if we've been if we've been rocking for like a year, year okay. or so, or something like that, and you know, we serious, and you know, you, you go to yeah. a relationship, and you like, yeah, 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 I gotta matter myself and, and either decide I'm gonna be the person in my life and make this happen or, or no. So like, okay. I think you can really find out about a person, even if a dude said that, you can really find out what that person really thinks of you if they, if they chuck the deuces and then go on, y'all been together, they're rocking. But would that person cheat more likely because they used to having it and they no longer have it? So it's gonna be two situations. That could be one of them. That's one scenario. And I was just gonna say, I like that trend, that, would be more likely. Yeah. Like if we had sex and then you want to do this other see and then we are in a relationship, uh, that's more likely to keep me around. Cause we already did it. I understand. And you already know what right. it's like. You what know what she's like. working yeah. with, y'all. So, I ain't letting it go. Right. Right. So, but, but so what you said most likely to cheat one that could be one or two. It could uh, expedite the. Process oh, of getting married. Mm -hmm. So you know you want to practice celibacy until we get married. Like okay, baby. Two months. Let me know if you're one right. knee. <laughs> you know, so, that ring will come out of nowhere. But you ain't. Yeah, but but most guys are not gonna go right. into a situation with them knowing that a girl. Right. If if you have yeah. if it's two unique new people, if two people <laughs> haven't been together right. before and you lead off with the celibacy, that dude, like you said, wanted to be like one of them dudes. Like I don't know what. I, most dudes, in my opinion, right. like, they don't want to deal with it. Like, it ain't gonna be a uh, initial. They ain't gonna want to come off as a as a jack. Yeah. 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 But you know, first the conversation gonna kind of dry out. And then it's gonna come it gonna be. Hey, how you doing? I ain't seen you in a long time. <laughs> oh, yeah. so be a time to like, dang. Hey, yeah, I changed changed number. <laughs> my phone broke. You got a new number. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Up, then they'll think of another life. Okay, you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and share this video with your other friends, family, and whoever that you want to. Hey, yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> that be like that. <laughs> <laughs> Stay tuned to all our next video. We got some more bangers coming, and yeah, I'm gonna try to leave um his handle. And the thing so y'all go follow my brother. But yeah, until our next video. Bye. Say peace. peace. Say peace, Cash.